Now that the Super Bowl and football season is officially over, the business behind the game actually begins. It's a story we've talked about before. The agreement between Texas A&M and the Seattle Seahawks use of the phrase the 12th man that expires in 2016. KAG's HD News reporter Chris Costa joins us in the studio. And Chris, what's the status of this agreement right now? Luke and Amanda, Texas A&M and the Seahawks franchise are still discussing the terms of a possible renewal. Texas A&M trademarked the phrase in 1990, and after an out-of-court settlement with Seattle, the Seahawks now pay $5,000 per year for limited use of the phrase. After back-to-back -back Super Bowl appearances for Seattle, it's safe to say the organization and fans could be concerned about the deal expiring during the team's next postseason run. The question is, what happens to the agreement come next year? We would like to continue the relationship with Seattle. So uh, those talks uh, have started and will continue to take place. And uh, hopefully we can continue to have a great partnership uh, with our friends uh, in Seattle. It's very important for Texas A&M and our students and our former students uh, to know that we are taking every possible step to ensure that that trademark, that that brand remains Texas A&M's. Hinkley adds that the concept of the 12th man is priceless and that they are less concerned with the financial aspect than the overall protection of the brand. Tonight at 10, hear what Aggie fans in Seattle think about the Seahawks' use of the phrase. Luke and Amanda.